trespasser. How to play? Meet your residence quota by allowing people into the building whilst disallowing um, anomalies. Identify anomalies by weird behavior such as twitching, missing lamps, or more. Keep emergency exits shut at all times to prevent unwanted visitors. Make sure the generator always has power. In the case of a trespasser, use the emergency phone. Alright, so I'm pretty sure we all know about that new game recently called That's Not My Neighbor. Which basically um, is like kind of a... I, I don't really know that much about it. I did see it trending a lot. I just don't really know like the gameplay that much. Um, but what I do know about is the fucking milkman that everyone simps for. I mean, it's just a milkman. I mean, there was a milkman in, like, the 2000s, and yet no one was simping for him. I mean, look at that guy. He got a shit. But yeah, anyways, basically, That's Not My Neighbor is basically kind of an anomaly-type game, you know? Where you basically, you basically, like, um, have to, like, watch out for people and stuff. Like, watch out for the bad people trying to get in and stuff, the anomalies and stuff, you know? So you basically have to, you know, like, take a good look at the person that wants to get inside the bunker or whatever the area is called and stuff, you know? And you gotta make sure that, like, he, like, they're, like, a normal person and not, like, some alien or whatever, so that they can get in. And I suppose if you actually get an anomaly inside of the building, then it's game over. And yeah, I guess this game will most likely have that same kind of gameplay and stuff. And possibly also have, like, a kind of Five Nights at Freddy's kind of gameplay and stuff. We have to, like, you know, keep the generator um, always running and stuff, you know? Like, have to do other objectives and stuff, like, during the game and stuff, you know? Like, all, all that good stuff. And yeah, so far, there's, like, two maps now, so, uh, I don't know if we're exactly gonna beat both of them, but it's worth a shot, honestly. Seriously, though, what is with, what is with this guy specifically, like, always having different outfits and stuff, you know? Like, like, it's always the same haircut, he always has a weird face... And the only, and the only other outfit he has instead of, like, you know, this fucking pilgrim, like, outfit is, um, a fucking dentist outfit. Like, is this, like, is this really just the game's milkman or something or what? I, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, it looks like we're most likely gonna play this guy right here. So, yeah, let's not waste any more time and let's get straight into Trespasser. Alright, here we are, Trespasser. So... Yeah, full volume all the way up. And yeah, we are a police officer. Yeah, so that's what we're talking about. Free skin for following. Alright, skin requirements. All these accounts on Roblox on Roblox, join the group. Um and press claim. Alright. Oh wait, that's right. I can't even click on it, so what's the point of even doing it in the first place? But yeah, anyways, yeah, see Pilgrim. Um four hundred and forty nine bull box. Dear lord. Faster sprint, one faster um than the monster. I'm sorry, what fucking monster is it talking about? You know, anyways. VIP, 49 Bola. That is pretty damn cheap. Reward the game. Special chat tag. Lobby cosmetics on character. And more soon. Alright. Chunker fast flashlight. 150 Bola. Much brighter flashlight. No shit, it said Chunker flashlight. Alright. <coughs> anyways. Um, two times stamina. Um, sprint for way longer. No kidding. Alright. All right. Anyway, so, um, yeah, we got a few... Oh, all right, join the game. All right, yeah, it's just typical. All right, anyways, um, yeah, all right, so we got Fancy Dude, 119 Bulbuck, Elfman, 139 Bulbuck, Chef, 89 Bulbuck, Robloxer, um, 875 Bulbuck, and Chicken Guy, 249 Bulbuck. You know what, we're gonna buy, um, this guy. We're gonna buy this little boy here, you know, since I have enough Bulbuck right now, so... Yeah, let's buy this shit. Boom. Boom. We bought, we bought something for once. Yeah. It's been a while since we bought something. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, now we got Robloxer on. Holy shit, I'm naked. Alright, is it gonna load in? Alright, there we go. Yeah. Robloxer. That's nice. Hooray. Yippee. Wahoo. Alright. So, yeah. Um, we got Map 1, the hotel. And, uh... Let's join this. Fuck it. We're gonna join this. Yeah, so Map 1, hotel. And Map 2, the hospital. So, yeah. First one, we're gonna... Wait, set. Wait, no, 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 I don't, I don't want to, uh, no, 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 fuck, 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 no, 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 hey, no, 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 fuck, fuck, fuck! Alright, let's try that again, uh, let's go into map one, the hotel. Fuck, alright then. Um, yeah, let's go. Yeah, select it, yes. Yes, map one, the hotel, yes. That's what I've been trying to play, so. Yeah, so. 
Um, we'll just try both of these, like, one try, I guess. Like, it depends how long we're actually gonna be in it, so... Yeah. First off, let's go with map one, the hotel. I don't even know if there's gonna be, a, like, any lore or story in this game, but... Whatever. Alright, yeah! Hotel! Yeah, so... Recharge the power in the basement. Oh, dear. Close all emergency exits. Alright, we got some Five Nights at Freddy's kind of stuff here, huh? Alright, so... Residents remain in, alright. Call the phone, alright. Let's go. Alright, that part... Let people in, don't let suspicious people in. Keep emergency exits shut and keep the generator running. So, anomalies defeat it. Oh, okay then. Um, let residents in. Um, look out for suspicious um, residents. Keep emergency exits shut or anomalies may sneak in. Use the camera for ca use the computer for cameras. Recharge, um, charge the generator to avoid losing power. If you suspect an anomaly inside, is inside, call the phone. Um, you can safely hide in crates. All right then. So it's basically kind of not, that's not my neighbor. Yeah, it's basically kind of a, like a, that's not my neighbor and like Five Nights at Freddy's. Like basically, if you took like Five Nights at Freddy's and that's not my neighbor, mix it up together, and then boom, you got yourself um, trespasser. So yeah, pretty interesting concept, honestly. You know. <clears throat> Wait, that. Honestly, I do like some of these games. Like, it mix up, mixes up two, two, like, popular games as gameplays and stuff. And simply just, um, you know, make it into one, you know, crazy playthrough and stuff, you know. Which I do enjoy very much, so. Yeah. So, um, joystick to sprint. Uh, what, f what button for flashlight? Can I even give? All right. So yeah, um, we're basically just gonna need to like invite se eight re residents and, ba and we basically complete the game. So, all right. So I suppose they'll just um, do all of that, and I'll basically just keep an eye out for the for other. Okay, I guess we'll just do that then. All right, look out for suspicious residents. Um. Alright, so there's three knights then, huh? Is it gonna, like, notify us if there's, like, a door opening or something? Probably. Um, oh. Okay, I guess we just already let him in. Oh, okay, hello there. How you doing, good sir? Do you have anything to say? Should I let him in? I don't know what he's saying, honestly. I'll just let you in for the sake of it. Go on in. Go on ahead. <clears throat> I guess we don't really have to, like, keep a good eye out and stuff. Because I guess they're, you know, obviously just going to have some strange activity with them and stuff, you know? So, yeah. Yeah, so, that, like, the other people will just, you know, simply, you know, um, keep an eye out for, yeah, the, the people. Meanwhile, I'll just, you know, um... Keep an eye out for the doors, the generator, and stuff. You know, the good. I don't feel like it's gonna... Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Alright, it's not gonna remind us. It's not gonna remind us that um, someone's gonna break in. That is, that is not a good sign. Oh, dear. I do not like that. Alright. Alright, look. Okay, so... I'll go from door to door, keeping an eye out, and that guy, yeah, the, yeah, the other person who's the only other only one in the server as well, will basically, um, you know, be like a little DreamWorks makes the teamwork, you know, not DreamWorks Studios, teamwork makes, yeah. But yeah, it seems like in each map there's like n like three knights, so gotta remember that. So yeah, it looks like these are the, these are the only two emergency exits and stuff, so. We don't really have to worry about, you know, exploring the entire damn, you know, area. Unless if there's actually more that I do not, did not recognize. Is there, like, more emergency? Aha! There's more. Oh, no. Close that. Cl close that immediately. So, th make that three, I guess. <laughs> uh, all right. 
Yeah. Make that three here? Um, I swear I just heard something. Wait, is that something gonna open it? No. Alright, so one in here. Alright, so, yeah. Yeah, moral of the story is just keep an eye on these damn. Yeah. So there's about three emergency exits around this building and stuff, you know? No, yeah, obviously they'll basically go from like doors to do like doors, like emergency exit to emergency exit and stuff. And then you basically have to find, a, find it around the map quickly before they actually get in, so. <clears throat> Hello? Oh, oh, okay. Alright, there we go. So, yeah. Pretty simple, honestly, you know? I mean, what could possibly go wrong in this kind of, kind of game? I always feel like I'm hearing something. I just don't know what it could be. <clears throat> there we go. Alright, so just one more resonance, and then we move on to the next night. And I suppose that the more we play, the more difficult it actually gets, so... Yeah. You see, I'm actually getting used to this game, actually, you know? Nothing bad's happening so far. Alright, yeah, that's closed. That's good. Yeah. Obviously, there's most likely a time limit and stuff to, like, quickly close one of the emergency X. At, f at first, I thought... Okay. Night... Oh. Oh, dear. More sections are gonna be unlocked then, huh? And <laughs> not fun. Not fucking fun. Alright. Alright then, so... <clears throat> yeah, we obviously have to survive, survive all the nights and stuff, you know? And then, yeah, so... Yeah, I saw another lever, so that means... Uh, I'm gonna have to keep an eye out for another emergency exit. Believe me. As Chris McLean would say, not cool, dude. Um. Alright, yeah. Uh, eh? So, yeah, I guess I'll basically, yeah, I'll basically, like, run around from, like, you know, the office to, like, over here and stuff, you know, so, yeah. Yeah, and obviously the other person will... Never mind, no other person. I'm all alone. Very happy. Oh, son of a bitch. Um, now I have to, um, let people in and stuff. Problem is, I, they don't really, you know, speak, you know. Hey, that's fine. Go on. Go ahead in. Alright. This is not very fun. I have to, like, you know, let people in and also keep an eye out for these emergency exits. Which is extremely not fun, like I said. Yeah, I would probably need at I I would probably need people to actually help me with this because obviously since I'm, since I'm on Xbox, looks like that people can't really talk. Like I can't see the chats and stuff. Uh, no, fuck you. Oh shit. I guess I'll... Eh, go ahead. Yeah, you most likely need your flashlight when... Blows that bitch! Hell no. You, you get the fuck out of here, alright? You hear me? Hmm? If it's, like, pointed up and stuff, then that means they're trying to fucking get in, so. Yeah. Yeah, once again, it has, like, a gameplay of That's my Not My Neighbor with a mixture of Five Nights at Freddy's and stuff, where you have to, like, you know, let people in. Meanwhile, you can't, um... Yeah, meanwhile, you can't let, um... 
like you know, it, like creatures inside of the hotel and stuff because probably that's they're gonna ha try to harm the actual past like visitors and stuff you know, and that's not good for our company also you know because obviously nowadays companies want fucking money instead of you know actually you know entertaining people and stuff you know. Like remember like back then McDonald's you know was su was such a colorful place and stuff you know, like when you. When, like, when your mom said they're gonna get McDonald's, you were so excited and stuff, because you get to play in the play place and stuff, you know? Like, with all the pretty colors of flashing lights and stuff, you know? Um, nowadays, um, if you take a look at McDonald's now, um, it's, all it is is just fucking, like, it's just, like, gray and black and stuff. Like, it's not, like, as colorful as back in the day and stuff, you know? Like, like, what happened, what happened to, fuck, no. You get the fuck out of here. Stay out of my sight. Um. Or you know what? Yeah, I can actually use the camera to actually, you know. Or. Ah! Who the fuck? Yeah, that's a. Uh, no. That's a fuck no for me. Um. Okay, I wanted to use the cameras, but yeah, that just kind of ruined it for me. So thanks so much, game. Game! Alright. Oh, fuck. This is gonna take quite a while, because... Um, no one's really helping me, honestly, you know? Like, actually letting people in and stuff, you know? While I'll... While I, while I like, do, like, the extra stuff, you know? So... Hello, sorry about that. Uh, go on in. Chew. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, now let's do, a uh, way... Okay, don't worry. Alright, now we're gonna do a daily... Or just, a uh, Minutely. No one even said that before, but minutely. Uh, close that bitch. Like, will it say that Anomaly has gone in and stuff, and then you have to hide and stuff, and then, like, you know... I don't know if, it's that, if that's gonna remind us. Most likely not. We're gonna have to do things our own, own way and stuff, you know? <clears throat> like, work around up and stuff, you know, so we have to actually, you know, but you, you get it, so, you know, let's, there we go, uh, go on ahead, buddy, go on, jummy little bud pal, and yeah, it looks like the more nights you go through, the more, like, residents you have to, like, welcome in and stuff, you know, so, yeah, I have to do this every single time I let someone in and stuff, you know, and it takes up much more time of my life, so, yeah, happy life for me. Even though I'm only, like, 14 years old so far. No one has, no creature has really used the, the new section's door and stuff, huh? Yeah. Yeah, this game is most likely recommended to, like, friends and stuff, you know? Um, with friends, you know? Because they, because not only is it more fun, but you, they can obviously, like, you know, help you and stuff. So that you don't have to run around the... Fuck, 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 ah! And to that, and most likely that guy is just going to be waiting there until GTA 6 comes out. Well, that was a fun experience, wasn't it, you know? Yeah, let, let, fuck it, let's join this, let's, let's join these guys. Yeah, how, how you doing, guys? Yeah, ever heard of my channel? Probably not, you know? Probably watching Dan TDM and stuff, you know? Yeah, better YouTubers than me, honestly, you know? Alright, yeah. Not even going to bother trying to beat that, um, but yeah, so. Alright, so, yeah, let's do this, so... And yeah, we got a lot more resin. Okay. Wait. Incinerate dead patients to dispose of ghosts. Okay. Um, give, give the patient a heal. Okay, this is completely new, I guess. Um. Or at least this person actually knows what he's doing, obviously, you know? Alright, looks like we got... Give vitamins to heal patients. Uh, take it. 
Alright, so I sup yeah, so most likely I suppose that like, you know, if like this is like, you know, keep moving up and down, then obviously they're alive and you get them vitamins, but if it's just like, you know, straight line, then you obviously disintegrate them. Um decline suspicious staff, give vitamins to patients, dead patients upon ghosts, and incinerate to get rid of ghosts. So yeah. <clears throat> now once again it is most likely not even gonna, you know, remind us that like, you know, someone's dying and stuff, you know, obviously, so yeah, so like one person can like you know obviously let the staff in, and one person and yeah obviously one person can um. All right, so I see. Okay, so yeah, if it's basically if it basically goes to like you know one health, then you have to quickly give them vitamins and stuff so they don't die. And if and if you are too late and they do die, then you simply have to you know incinerate their body so that no ghosts can get in and basically kill you and haunt you for the rest of your life. So, yeah. Pretty unique, um, idea, so, yeah. So, once again, most likely someone can, like, you know, let the staff in and stuff, you know. Yeah, see, someone let that, yeah, so, they can basically let staff in, and then the rest of the server can simply, you know, um, just keep an eye out on the patients and stuff, you know. And we have, and we basically have to do this every single night and stuff, you know, to actually, oh, looks like he's really about to die, so. Oh, never mind. Um, I guess I'll just keep this, just in case, you know. Can I eat the vitamins? No, I guess not. Um, alright then. Yeah, see? See, at least, um, I'm actually in a server where people actually know what they're doing. Because it's a lot worse than... Because it's a lot worse to actually be in a server where no one even knows what the hell is going on. Yeah. Simply if an anomaly, if, like, a ghost actually appears and stuff, then obviously you have to, you know hide in a crate, and if you're, if, if you think the coast is clear, then you obviously have to, like, you know, call, like, whatever phone number and stuff to actually get the ghosts out of the, out the hell of there, alright, alright, there we go, so, yeah, yeah, just make sure the patients don't die, and if they, oh, for a second, I thought they died and stuff, you know, so, and yeah, um, Alright, yeah. See, this is a lot more easier and stuff, you know, because we actually got people here helping us, you know. Yeah, only like three people, but at least hopefully one of them's actually letting the people in, obviously, you know. Because that would not be a good thing, you know, because I would not, most likely not want to, you know, actually, you know, play this all alone again. So. Oh, yeah, right, the generator. Fuck, I forgot about that thing. What? What happened? Um, alright then. Alright, let me see. No, no one... Alright. So, uh, I guess that doctor's actually helping us, I guess? Most likely? Alright. Well, um... Alright. So, yeah, see, this is easy. This is easier, honestly. I don't know if we're still gonna be able to beat this, but it's worth a shot, honestly. So... Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, what, that was a ghost in here or something? Why are we hiding? Yes. Oh, of course. I was using my fucking stamina too much. Oh, okay. Yeah, just make sure don't make sure you don't let any um page like a um, monster, you know, ghost in and stuff, you know, because that is not good, and we will most likely, um, die from that, so, alright, um, hello, go in, yeah, and I suppose if you let, like, a suspicious person in and stuff, then they'll most likely, you know, kill you or something, I don't know, something like that, um, alright, yeah, they're good, <clears throat> Yeah, I do like this gameplay, though, you know? Like, actually, yeah. 
It's like, you know, Resident's Massacre, where you have to keep moving around and stuff, you know? Yeah, it's like one of those, yeah, obviously one of those games where you have to, like, keep moving around and stuff to not fucking die and stuff, you know? Kind of like their gameplay, so. Alright, um, yeah, that, yeah, that person's doing the, what, like, letting people in thing. And the other two are, no, just me, I guess? Did someone die? I just, I just fucking heard something I didn't like. Hello? Someone die? Oh, no shit, someone was about to die. Um, alright. Take vitamins. Here we go. <clears throat> alright, yeah, there we go. So, yeah. I guess it's just me and the pro player of this game. Yeah. Boy, what a lucky server I'm in. Yeah, I'm never using the flashlight. You get the fuck out of here, you disabled fuck. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Alright. Alright, yeah, you'll do that. And yeah, just four more people, and then we have to go to night two, and then yada yada yada, blah blah blah, yada da da da. All right, you, you get it. So, yeah. All right. And I gotta get used to like the, the layout of this map and stuff, you know. Uh, should you really trust that face? Look at that face. That's the face that the Chihuahua has. I'll let you choose that. Alright. Uh, I guess it'll just let her in, I guess. Alright, you'll do that. Meanwhile, I'll check on the patients. Oh, shit! Dang it! Ah! Oh, dude, that was a close one. See, this is pretty simple, honestly, you know? Yeah. Alright, yeah. Oh, is there still... Yep, there's still three nights, so... Yeah. I guess that I guess those doctors will actually help us, you know, with the patients. <clears throat> I guess yeah. Alright, yeah. Two more. Yeah, yeah, the rooms with the colors on them. We can actually go in. Alright, yeah, this one might actually be pretty easy, honestly, you know? As long as no- like, the other person doesn't leave the server at all. You can go in. There we go. 16! God! Okay. Whatever. That's fine. Okay, then. Sixteen resonance. Holy- please don't tell me. Okay, yeah. Alright, you can go in. Go on. <clears throat> yeah, so, yeah. Yeah, he'll basically take care of the patients, and I'll take care of, you know, this, you know. But that's not my neighbor kind of thing, you know. Hopefully I don't see any milk, man. Because some people will be releasing milk someday. All right. All right, I really hope he's still doing his job. I don't see him around. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll I'll do this, okay? Yeah, you you go on ahead. All right, yeah. 
So yeah, this will be a lot more easier and stuff. Since like meanwhile he'll like take care of the patients, and meanwhile I'll just you know do this, so it can go like a lot more faster. Instead, of both of us you know actually you know checking on the patients and stuff you know. So yeah, and obviously if one break if a ghost actually appears, then obviously we just you know. Oh wait, is there like no phone to actually take care of that? Oh shit, wait. There's no phone to actually take care of that. Oh god. Um that's not gonna be good. Um I, I guess the only thing you have to do is just hide, I guess, and then he'll just go away, maybe? I don't know. Or it's like if you if if that happens then you're fucking dead and stuff. So Yeah. See, this is a lot more faster, like I said, so. Yeah, we might actually beat this one, honestly, if we're actually being real honest, you know? I got one person that actually, that has probably actually, you know, played the the game and stuff, you know? A lot. And there's and there's me, like, put, starting to play the game and starting to get to know what to do. But he's more of a pro than me in this game. So, you can go in. Alright, nine more people left, yeah. Like, yeah, the reason why it took a much w longer while and stuff previously is obviously because we were both checking on the patients and stuff, you know? And you get it, so. Yeah. I may have not played That's Not My Neighbor, but I did, like, you know, see a little clips of the game and stuff, especially the Milkman. Believe me, I've been seeing a lot of sims of that character. You know, it's just one person who's just a fucking Milkman and stuff. Yeah. People get people will just simp for anything at this point, you know. I can only see assets outside. I can see some of the fucking asset assets assets um outside of the map. Oh, <laughs> you get the fuck out of here. You're probably retarded or something, you know. But all right, yeah, yeah. I I'll, I'll do this. I'll. Nope. You get the fuck out of here. Hell no. Get your bitch ass out of here. No, get the fuck out of my hospital. I do not like that noise. If you have that kind of n noise coming out of your body, then you probably need help. So, yeah. And this is basically the, yeah. Yeah, that's simply the map of the... Yeah, that's simply the map of the hospital and stuff, you know? Like, these are the hallways, lobby, yada, 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 blah, blah, blah. Yeah, the color, some of the colors basically represent, um, yeah, the patient's rooms and stuff, you know. Yeah, thankfully, um, Jolk, Jules is, is, is Jolk, yeah, I'll, I'll just call him Jolk. Yeah, Jolk is, um, uh, still doing his job, so, good for him. Shout out to my boy there. Alright, you, my friend. Do you have legs? Yes, you do. Come on. All right, we might actually beat this one if I'm being real honest. Actually, you know. Yeah, what could possibly go wrong right, right now? It's not like he's gonna just yeah. See, see, like yet yeah, nothing's happening. Nothing bad is even happening. So, yeah, we are all good. Yeah. I I don't want to be too cocky and stuff because next thing you know, a ghost is gonna appear right behind. Get out. Get the fuck out. No, get your bitch ass out. You are not Spongebob ascending to some godly music. No, get out of here. Shoot. Shoot, you, you, you rascal. You silly goose. All right. Yep, you can go on. You're not floating like the, like the previous person. All right, yeah. I don't know if those doctors actually help us, I guess, you know? Maybe, maybe not. Maybe so. Maybe ho. I don't know. All right, just three more people. Joke is still in here. Hopefully, it's not gonna kind of find a battle where all of a sudden Joke disconnects in the last round and stuff, and I basically have to do everything and stuff, you know. Which believe me, it's not fucking good. Uh, and you get out of here, disabled fuck. All right, <laughs> I'm a menace. Um, all right, all right, yeah, you do that. So look, see, we don't even need four people. All we need is just like you know two people. One doing the. You know, letting in, and the other one just doing the rest. You know, the generator, the patients. And thankfully, like, the patients don't, like, you know, lose their health extremely fast and stuff, you know? That's a good thing, at least, you know? Alright. 
go in. Yeah, just one more resident, and then we'll go on to the last night, and then ho hopefully it's not like 30 residents. Otherwise, that's not going to be good. And I su you know, I suppose like the more nights we actually go through, the more like the patient's health will actually, you know, die out and stuff, you know. It's like, we're already doing good and stuff, you know. All right, so yeah, you can go through. 20! 20 residents, all right. All right, 20 residents, let's do this. I guess the faces don't really matter when it comes to suspicious activity. Or maybe. <clears throat> I don't know. Or, but yeah, it looks like Joel is still just running around the entire damn map, you know? But it's actually going pretty good, if I'm being real honest, actually. Like, that, that's serious. It's that, we're actually doing pretty good, uh, actually. Hell, I, didn't, I don't even need a friend and stuff to help me doing the, do this and stuff, you know? All, we, all you need is just, like, an actual good player and stuff. Yeah. Don't worry. I got... Don't worry. I got I got all good. You, do, you don't need to worry a thing. Just keep going to the patient, and we're all good. Somehow, I'm able to beat map 2, but not map 1. I mean, obviously, I was, like, alone in that. And don't even want to bother actually trying to play it again, you know. So I have better things to do, but. <clears throat> yeah. What the duck is left to talk on? Who's gonna come in next? You get the fuck out, you disabled piece of shit. Alright. Yeah. Like. Not letting pe people in doesn't count as like a resident remain in a thing, you know, so. So obviously you're not letting them fuck in. Because obviously they're anomalies. They are not good. They will kill you. They will, they, they will stab stab you, so. Yeah. Who the fuck? Alright, right, I don't, I don't want to question what's in, on your face, but go on ahead. You know, I'll basically do this, you know, where I can see who's coming and like the generator and stuff, you know. See, we are actually doing good, actually. I know I'm saying this a lot, but yeah, we are actually doing pretty swell, honestly, you know? Yeah, besides, it's even like the first try as well, right? Yeah, the first try. Yeah, very crazy, I know. You, I don't really beat things first try. Alright, two more people, and then we're all good. Yeah. Probably just let that, you know... Yeah, obviously they don't, like, have any arms or anything like that, or have creepy faces, or, like, you know, um, alright, yep, and, boom, you won, I did win, we both won, let's go, you survived, yeah, let's go, alright, and there we go, that was Roblox Trespasser, yeah, 
basically like a gameplay mixed with mixed uh yeah it's basically like a mixture of gameplay of like that's not my neighbor and five nights at freddy's where not only do you have to you know like um let people in and not let people in and stuff you know um and obviously watch out for anomalies um you also have to you know like, like run around the map like doing other stuff and stuff you know like not letting any creatures in and stuff you know and like actually hiding from them and stuff, you know. Yeah, it's a pretty like interesting, you know. But yeah, I do like some when when it comes to these Roblox games where they basically like take two popular games like mechanics and stuff, and they basically mix them together into one Roblox game to actually make it a fun little experience, you know. Yeah, it's pretty interesting if I'm gonna be real honest. So yeah. I am still naked. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you want to play more Roblox games like these, where you basically have, you know, watch out for anomalies, that kind of stuff, or if you want to notify me as I update one of these Roblox um, games I did play before, but I never heard the update, then suggest I'm on the group below my Roblox group, the Plays YT group. You can click the link in the description below as a little paragraph, or you can do a long way to search your own Roblox group, the Plays YT group, and it's mostly the first one to pop up. And here's the other Roblox group, though. You got to just more of the Roblox experience, like games and stuff. Like, you should just play these pictures, extras, and holiday specials, ideas, fails me to interact on YouTube, like real trailers. Like, those that be Roblox games specifically, you can leave you anything. Just to make sure it's not appropriate for obvious reasons. Also, quick notes though, if the Roblox game that you, that you suggest is not Xbox 4 in the moment, they'll basically say in the Google Blog that it's not Xbox 4, but when it does become Xbox 4 in the future, I'm mostly hoping you're meant to play it. Also, suggestions to give me toilet related games are not allowed, so suggestions to give me toilet related game, then be comment deleted, and I was the first warning from the ex off from the group. Also, be due to the Roblox game though, or not if I made the update one of these Roblox games I did play before Brandon Hammer the update. And it's never made a video about yet. The two things that I have it right now. Number one, I'm probably busy recording other Roblox games and stuff because I used to record just one last. Or number two, I'm probably busy doing something else, you know, like animation or, or a complete different project that I have, haven't have revealed or announced yet. Like Piggy and Alcor. But don't worry, the Roblox team that you suggest will super record from me. Although, yeah, 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 Roblox profile by chance the YouTube channel. Also, do not teach me any Roblox games made by people on the platform who don't know good things, you know, like game, fan, big games. I explained it both of times. Your comment deleted it. And it's not a warning. I just only social that kind of stuff. Also, do not trust me any robots R63 games. That one is self-explanatory. You back out from the group without any warnings. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Puggy Boys YT is time for now. I'm obviously not gonna deal with that shit. And I'm gonna, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And as always, peace out.